John Kavakis here, and this is my take on Brooklyn's 1934 Ford Five Window Coupe. Now, uh, the 34 Fords were part of the Model B series, came after the Model A series. Um, they were pretty popular. Uh, they came equipped with a 221 cubic inch V8 engine, uh, had dual Stromberg downdraft carburetors, three speed manual transmission, it had aluminum heads, pretty advanced for its time. Uh, it made 90 horsepower. It made for great performance. As a matter of fact, it was made infamous by Bonnie and Clyde as they used that as their, their chosen getaway car. Uh, so the five window coupe uh, came in uh, two trim levels, standard and deluxe. Uh, the standard was pretty standard. Uh, had little things on it like the seat was adjustable, had a sun visor uh, on the driver's side only, had a roll down window in the back and an interior light and a glove box. So um, those were standards. Now the deluxe version, a little bit different than what we consider deluxe today, but uh, the, it had a chrome windshield cover, it had dual horns, dual auxiliary lights. Uh, it came with dual sun visors, uh, cowl light, uh, it had a driver's side armrest, and even went so far as to give you a cigarette lighter and an ashtray. Uh, so this is the, the deluxe model. And you know, I, I enjoy these uh, second looks at Brooklyn's because uh, there are some models that sometimes fly under the radar. And uh, this one is definitely worthy of a second look. Let's get it up here and take a look at this. Now, I want, I want you to know, see what I just did? Okay. Uh, I've been able to take this car out without touching it, without putting the gloves on. Uh, I love that idea. Uh, it's one of the hidden advantages of the box that maybe doesn't always get appreciated. Nobody offers packaging that uh, allows you to take the model out without touching it. And if you want to put it on display, it's just, you know, we all have some special model we'd like to put on special display somewhere. And this is an opportunity to do that. Just one of the little things about the box that nobody talks about too much. So let's take the, put this on the, the turntable and take a look at it. Okay, the color, paint, uh, typical Brooklyn, beautiful paint, lustrous, even, deep, very nicely done. Uh, details, the uh, grill is beautifully uh, black washed. The, uh, it's got the dual horns. Uh, there are no lenses on the lights. Uh, the hood, uh, the trim along the hood, is very delicately done with a great hood ornament. Uh, the spare tire and the wheels are very well done. They're very good uh, replicas of the 1-1. One -one. Uh, so they've just done a marvelous job on, on, the, on the wheels and uh, it's hard to get uh, in 143rd. Uh, door handles are separate. Uh, the hinges in the rear of the suicide doors are, are interesting. Uh, it's got a nice window frame around it. A little flat for photo edge, but not too bad. Looks very much like the original. Uh, windshield wipers are appropriately spaced at the top. It's got the soft top insert in the middle. This is a nice model. Um, it, I think that uh, uh, again, this one kind of gets lost a little bit in the difference between the Brooklyn Limited Collection, the Brooklyn Collection, the Limiteds are 30s and 40s, the collection is 50s, 60s and above. Um, and it's been around for a while. Now, here's a great thing about this model. Um, uh, well, you know what, let me, let me go to the five star and then I'll tell you what's really great about the model. So our five star rating on the car and Fidelity, I'm going to give this a five. Trim, lensing and badging, uh, a four. Uh, I'd like to see some lensing in the front, but I've got a little bit more to say about that. Uh, color is five, interior detail, three, uh, the dash could be picked up a little bit better. Uh, the steering wheel is accurate, um, but I'd like to see more jewelry inside. Uh, wheels and tires, we give it a five, and the value. Now, this is the, the, the prime point of this car. Uh, it sells at 110 pounds, just under 110 pounds just under $150. It's an incredible value on a white metal model, uh, which sells somewhere around 75-80% of what normal ones do. So it's just a beautiful model, and for a value, I'm giving this a five. Uh, that brings our total uh, up to 25, and that gives the, uh, the My Take 5-star rating a 4.5. That's a 4.5 for Brooklyn's 1934 5-window coupe. Thanks for spending time with me. I'll talk to you again sometime soon.